Hello then, welcome to Air Hauler 2 with me. I'm only joking. Farming Simulator 2017 on the uh, on the new map. It's Stancia Lepacho. I've probably uh, mispronounced that, but uh, yeah, it's the um, South American uh, map, um, and it looks gorgeous. Got a nice pink tree in front of our uh, our mansion. That's just what you want—is a nice pink tree. Um, yeah, if I had any tree, it would be a pink one. Uh, yeah, this mansion's it's okay, you know. It's <laughs> it'll do. Um, and I don't know whether we. Oh, you can open the door. Oh, look at that. Oh, this is brilliant. Can you do anything with the? No. Nope. Oh, this is a. Uh... Oh, this is great. It's our living room. And go out into the courtyard, I guess. Yeah. And we've got a nice swimming pool. So after a hard days farming, we can uh, take some time out in our pool, have a barbecue, and listen to the radio. <laughs> um, okay, so uh, this episode is really going to be um, sort of having a look around the map. Uh, let's, have a, let's bring that up. Have a look around the map, see what's about, and um, so you could say this is like episode zero. I, I do this every every new official map. Uh, just have a look around and see what's uh oh, what's in here. Ah, there we go. That's what I was looking for. And lovely. So we jump into our jeep. And uh, let's head out and have a. So I'm going to come in and into this sort of camera view. I think so we can actually see see around. Well, we've got a plane. I love it. Absolutely love it. Um, so okay, so according to this is map. Uh, this is uh, field number fourteen, and this is the new sugar beet. Uh, not sugar beets. Uh, sugar canes, um, which is really cool. Ah, there, that's what, okay, so sugar cane. Uh, to sow sugar cane, you will need a billet planter like this. Says uh, Gesner single row billet planter. As with potatoes, the machine can be filled with sugar cane stalks of, of the last harvest. Oh, that's pretty cool. Uh, you can tip the stalks directly into the bullet planter or make use of a telehandler or wheel loader with a shovel attached to a, f to a fill machine. A shovel attached to fill the machine. Okay. Even without sugarcane stalks, you, st uh, you can start to plant sugarcane. Simply purchase a pallet of sugarcane in the shop. Okay, so this is a planter. It looks to be a single row planter. So, um, so yeah, that will take some time. So uh, what I might do is... This is a fairly big field, and it looks like they want to get us on sugar cane straight away. So it's a new thing for the uh, for platinum edition. We might get Ewan um, started with this straight away because it's going to take a while, I think. Um, while we have a explore, while we explore the uh, the map. So uh, let's turn those beacons on. Yes, miss the beacons, and we're uh, and we're getting going. Oh, wow, okay. So you can see the sugar canes are being sprayed with uh, fertilizer and then and then it's kind of drilled directly into the ground uh, one row at a time. But that's um Yeah, that's pretty that's pretty cool. So we'll leave uh, you and doing that. I don't know why I, I popped out. Um but uh, as you can see, it's uh, it's going to take a while. <laughs> um, yeah. So, what fields do we own? I think we own uh, we own fourteen, one, and two. Okay. Uh, I'm playing on a normal difficulty. I haven't gone hard or or easy. Um, but yeah, yeah. So let's. Uh, okay, it's a fairly big map. Um, wow, field number twenty nine is huge. Um, and there seems to be a train track going all the way around, uh, which is really cool. Um, oh, and you've got a harbour. I haven't seen a harbour in an FS map for a long time. I think it was 2011? 13? I'm not sure, but it's been a while. So uh, we're going to have a just a, a look around. Um, what's this, number 13? Let's see how much this field's worth. And I wonder if missions are in here as well. Um, that always helps when you've got missions. Harvesting. Hey, I'm a bit of a pickle. Maybe you can help. This field is uh, ready earlier than I expected. And all my regular guys are tied up with other work. If I don't get this harvesting quick, I'll 
it'll go past prime and be useless to me. 19,174 is a small price to pay compared to that. Okay, and you get a, ooh, a CR1090 and a Super Flex Draper, 45 foot header. That's pretty cool. And if you want to buy it, it's uh, 410,000. So, yeah, it's quite pricey, isn't it? But um, I'm glad the missions are in. Um, it's just nice and, you know, in between harvest and things, we can uh, we could do a few missions. So, where are we going to go? Well, let's head off up north. Uh, sort of northeast up to the transport company and have a have a butchers around there and how do I get rid of that again is it that yeah there we go get rid of that ugly box okay so there's the uh, the biogas plant over there in the east I love it because uh, you know the mud looks very red as clay I guess or um, very sandy you know in South America, it's, it's very. Blue. I imagine it being sunny like nearly every day, um, and there's a lot of fields, a lot of hills as well. Um, oh wow, look at that bridge! And what have we got over here? This seems to be the sheep area. So I'm a bit sheepish to go in there, to be honest. Boom, boom. Um, okay, so this is where we. Uh, this is where we keep our sheep. And that's where we feed them. So where's the nearest field? Okay, so this is the nearest field for the sheep. Now you wouldn't plant all that grass, would you? Um, where's the cows on here? Because you know how much I'm into my cows. Oh, the cows is actually near the farm by the look of it. And the pigs are in the top right um, northwest corner. Let's just go quickly look at the transport company. Which is over here. Uh, the map seems like really well laid out. Like you're not going to get lost too much. Um, oh, I just hit a tree. You see that? <laughs> what happens? Um, I am going to reduce my time though. Um, I don't want to be playing around with the time too much. But uh, while we're looking around and not actually doing anything, can we do that? Um, yeah, time scale, real time. That's fine. I don't want too much of the day to go past before we start our proper episode. Wow, these uh, are certainly very windy roads, and, and this pickup's quite quick. It's very it reacts quick to your. Uh, oh god! Am I going the right way? Okay, you wouldn't be in a tractor up here for sure. Yeah, a tractor and a trailer. Okay, I'm totally off. Uh, off route. So how would you get up there? Don't think you'd be driving on the tracks to get here, would you? Uh, this is like a. Oh, so this is just a selling point then. This is where you just sell it. Um. Well, um, I'm sure I shouldn't be doing this. But um. Oh, look at that! Look at the view. So you can see the um, yeah the sheep farm there. Ah, right in the back of it there, there's some grass. So it looks like we can use that grass over there to, uh, you know, for the sheep. Um, I didn't tell you I uh, adapted my uh, truck in, you know, in with tracks. <laughs> yeah, so we're quite dodgy about this. Palm trees and all sorts. Okay, let's see if we can get back on a proper road in a second. So we're coming up now over to the west, uh, sorry, east. And this seems to be where you can load. Yeah, okay. Oh, so login. Oh, this is the login area. Oh, brilliant. So you load logs here and then. You Sort of get look, um, onto the conveyor line and, and cut and shredded into planks. Oh, that's pretty cool. And there's your sawdust. Lovely. So, where are we now? Um, okay, so we come out of here, turn left, and we head towards the pigs. I think they're pigs. But uh, yeah, please uh, 
give this first video a, a bit of a thumbs up. That would be much appreciated. Thank you. And I hope to do um, a full series on uh, Farm Simulator. Now it's going to be a fairly slow. Oh, this uh, this bridge isn't. Oh look at that! So someone's fell off the bridge. <laughs> I'll uh, I'll send help. Yeah, gotta be a bit careful going over this bridge. Considering these are big fields and there's some big, big attachments and big, uh, big tractors. Uh, it's um, you know some of these uh, lanes are a bit. Um, you know you have to think about where you're going before you go there. Okay, so this is the uh, the pig farm. I presume this. Uh, let's go in and have a look. Yeah, these are definitely pig bins. You can, you can tell. Yeah, there's a pig trough. Cool. Okay, so pigs are uh, are in the game. Is that a water? Oh, that's, that's nice, isn't it? There's a water bowser just there. Uh, so you fill the water bowser up. Um, hmm. Oh, that's good to know. Okay, so we got pigs. Uh, wh where's the nearest field? Oh, number twenty-six, just over here. So this could be our uh, sort of feeding of the pig field. I like to have the fields near where, um, you know, where the uh, where the animals are. How much is this? Sixty-four thousand. Uh, oh man, my back is killing me. You must have pulled it getting that dang tractor out the pond. Oh, you left the bus in there, though. Don't ask. Anywho, I need someone to fertilize the field for me while I sort this out. If you're interested, there's two grand in it for me. Um, no, we're we're okay for the moment. We're uh, we're exploring. We're new to the area, but thank you very much for the offer. Um, so that's pretty cool. Our pigs. Okay, where are we going now? Uh, we want to turn left here and then head towards the grain elevator. And go over this uh, rickety bridge. I'm sure there's loads to explore in these maps. They, they always are. They always put some hidden extra. I don't know whether there's nuggets in here or not. I, um, I'm sure... There'll be a video up very soon of somebody finding a hundred nuggets. But, uh. Oh, that bridge over there as well. I do like the look of this map. It, it does give you that feel of, of being in South America, believe it or not. You know, it does. You know, with the, the red dirt tracks and, and. It just looks hot and humid. Uh, and it's nice that the farm fields are, are given, you know, this this landscape a bit of colour. That's great. Okay, so this is the grain. So I guess you pour it in there. And yep. Oh, okay. And then it load up, up onto the uh, onto the train, and you can sell it at the train point. I see. So we've got a shop down here. I think that. Oh, I think this is the uh, vehicle shop. Still, a truck is a bit too quick for its own good. Um, so, go see the vehicle shop. <laughs> it's just red mud at the front. Oh, we need to drive through. Now, I've got a load of um, load of mods installed. Uh, just some some random mods, really. Um, why are my money's going down quite a lot? Um, why? Are, <laughs> that's, that's a lot of money I'm losing. Hang on, I'll sort that out in a second. Um, yeah, why am I losing that much money? No, no, no. Uh, off. Oh, no, 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 no. We don't want that. We don't want that. Use my own. Um, Manure, slurry, fertilizer, seed. Yeah, that's why I was losing so much money. So he's actually buying the seed as I was going, um, or the um, the sugar cane, and that's why I was losing so much money. <laughs> Whoops! Turn those beacons on. Um, okay, looks like we curved that for a little bit. Ooh, that was uh, that was lucky. Okay, so let's have a let's have a look. I'll show you some of the mods I got installed. Um, Category brands, category brands. 
thought there was a dedicated mods thing, but maybe it's all in, in into one. But what's new is the sugarcane harvesting. Um, I think this is the one that we've got already. Yep, we've got one of these. So this is the one that we got. Uh, single row billet planter. You can also get the driveless. Um, a sew machine you can sew fields with. That's the new new sign for sugarcane. Uh, I don't know what the difference is between these two. Are they single row? Um, okay, that just hold a lot more. Oh yeah, okay. Yeah, they're both a meter meter wide. Uh, this is two meters, and this is the two row billet planter. So that's just like an upgrade to that one. And you got the lizard. Um, this is the harvest harvesting you know, single row harvester. And it looks like you have got this multi row, which looks pretty cool. Um, and then you've got the got the special. Um, trailers uh sugarcane trailers are able to tip their bins high in order to fill larger trailers directly um so that's pretty cool and then i don't think you could put sugarcane into silos so you need to eat, keep them um and i think what a lot of people do probably would be keeping them in these um in these trailers that's 66 000, you know 66,500 liters that's a lot um and they're not that expensive so yeah so that was new um and also, uh, we, I think we got a new sprayer um, currently. Uh, I got some mods so that they probably show up. But um, God, they look awful. <laughs> I don't know what these are. Uh, I think it's yeah, Stara. Stara is the new make. Um, so we got that one as well. Um, but yeah, I'm sure we're gonna get through through these uh, as we go. Um, some belt systems. Which are pretty cool. Uh, there's a slow conveyor for transporting pretty much e everything, which is great. Um, okay, yeah, but we'll get through to that at some point. So let's head back and continue our journey. So we're still losing loads of money, but at least I've reined it back a bit. I don't know. I hate that, that they uh, they choose the uh, to buy the seeds straight off the bat. It should be an option. Um, okay, let's go this way, down this way. Yeah, so if you haven't seen this map and this is the first time you've seen it, please let me know your thoughts down below. Um, I actually really like it. It, it. It's got a real good feel to it. It runs brilliantly, as you would expect from, from Giants. It, um, it is a lovely map. What's down there? Oh, okay, that's where we could have come out the other way. And looks like we're coming into the town or the city. Can we go over this bridge? Wow, that bridge looks brilliant. Nope, can't go over the bridge. It's all blocked off. So here we are. Uh, there seems to be a selling point here. Um, what selling point is that? That's the bakery. Okay, so that'll be where we sell our eggs and probably wheat, more than likely, or barley. Um, and along the front here, we have another selling point, I think, right in the corner. Oh look at these! I haven't seen these before. These are uh, sort of you know, bins, like collectors, you know, for sort of black bin bags. That's, that's brilliant. And I love the the stars of the cars and stuff here. You know, the cars are brilliant. Oh wow! Is that a pig? That's a pig or a sheep. Yeah, it's a statue of a pig or a sheep. Uh, so this is uh, is this the harbour? No, it's not the harbour, but it's uh. Very similar. So this is a spinnery. Okay, so we sell it here. This is where we sell the uh, the wool, and they turn it into. Oh. And they turn it into jumpers and stuff. Oh gosh. <laughs> so once you're back here, you're, you're stuck. You have to go the way you come. Um, yeah, let's have a a quick look up here. There's a nice sort of park area there's no traffic lights or anything right, we head off down this way and oh what's this bit of football oh we've got you aren't we eh? let's go score a goal this is going to be really difficult isn't it to... I don't know how to kick it let's go <laughs> throw it <laughs> In the net. <laughs> I don't know the throw. 
No. Okay, I'm gonna have to literally walk it. Yay! Go. Um, I love it when they do things like this. It's uh, it's really random and nice to find. Oh, uh, what have we got through here? Ah, uh, this is our chickens. Okay. Do we actually own any chickens at the moment? Is there any eggs in here? Oh, that's nice that there's a gap. I was going to say just enough for, the for, for us to fit through. Um, I don't know if they've laid anything. Anything in here? Behind here? Nope. Can you get in here? Nope. Okay, well that's the that's where the chickens are. I don't think I've actually picked anything up, which, but um, yeah, cool. And what's this place here? Can we get in here? No, <laughs> you're definitely not getting in there with that um, a piece of metal across the door. Okay, let's head on over to the harbour. It's always nice to find out where things are and have a have a have a good look around the map. I think we're all going to be spending a lot of time here, so. Oh, there's a boat. So this is the harbour, and you can hear things. Uh, can you? Nope. Nope, you can just hear sort of machinery. Um, hopefully, hopefully you can pick that up. Okay, so this is where we can load all our stuff. Let's go onto the ships when we need to sell at the harbour. Is that is it moving? No. And there's another ship down there. I don't know whether they move or whether they're static. It's pretty cool on the harbour. I haven't had a harbour. We haven't had a harbour for ages. Um, so it's uh, it's good to see. Okay, I didn't think it was going to let me go through there. It's the same as the uh, the other place. And that's where it, that's the tipping point there, I guess. Okay, cool. All right, we're nearly done. We'll just uh, have a butchers along here. Oh, this truck is fast. Where does this go down here? Ah, we can see the boat. It's a big old cargo boat there. And there's another center point down here. Oh, it sounds very loud. Where are we? We're at the sugar mill. Okay, so this is probably where we're going to sell the uh, sugar canes to. I would have thought so. And there's your selling point there. Oh, that's sweet. Do you get it? That's sweet. Yeah, yeah. Sugar. Sugar beans. Sweet. Um. Okay. Down here. Oh, what's that over there? Oh, it's a petrol station. And this is. What's this? Uh, the grain elevator. Is that a bank, is it? And a bank? Oh, it looks like a selling point for straw, possibly. I'm not sure. I can hear cows. Oh, this is where you buy the um, buy the animals. Okay, and maybe sell the straw. I think. Cool. Um, we we'll go down here. Check out the uh, the biogas plant. There's a grain elevator over there, so you can load up some grain there, and then sell it at the transport company. 
This is the biogas plant. Just cross over. And they've got a, like a little way bridge as you come in. And there's the silos. Okay. Ah, that's the selling point just there. So you haven't got that rotary that, yeah, that having to lift up your boom and, and drop it into a thing. It, it's quite nice and easy just to place it in there. Okay, that's nice and cool. So we've got these bigger high walled silos, which is nice to see. And, um, and yeah, we've all seen a biogas plant before, but it's quite nice to see. And there's your way bridge going out. Nice big field here, ready for uh, primed for um, for corn. How much does that cost? Oh, two hundred and five thousand. Okay. Well, that's it. I think we've seen we've seen a lot of it. We've uh, kind of done a full circle. Um, head back to the farm and see how. See how Ewan's getting on with the um, with the sugar cane. Um, I'm glad I started it early because it was gonna it's gonna take a good good while. And the map is 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 big, um, and there's a lot of fi you know big sized fields, but it's small enough that you can just get around quite easily. Um, you know, we're back at the farm already. Oh, there's it, the horn, which is great. Yeah, he, he's gonna be doing that a while, so. We're probably leaving to do that for a few episodes. Um, something I want to check before we go quickly is what have we got in our silos? Okay, so we've got yeah we've got product in our silos, which is great. Um, now where are our silos? <laughs> um, that's the house. It wouldn't be in the house. Oh, we haven't actually had a look at the farm, so I've, I've taken you everywhere but the farm. <laughs> okay, so this looks like to be the uh, the filling point for the silos. I don't know why I didn't drive over, but there we go. And yeah, this is the filling point. The other pit, yeah, the other places where we uh, uh, also cows. Okay, so this is the cow area, which is right next to our farm, which I like. I do like that. Um, and this. I think is where we load the cows in. I, uh, uh, probably, yeah. I think that's where we load the cows in. So let's have a look at what equipment we get started with then. Um, we've got a nice, it looks to be like a a cedar uh, fertilizer, which is nice. We've got a sugarcane trailer off the bat. Uh, oh, we've got a lovely uh, 47, 4709 Massey Ferguson. Oh, I love these tractors. They look... Uh, they look awesome. Got a nice little trailer to start with. There's a cultivator. Oh, we have a, a few seeds. We have a um, a front loader, fork, and bucket. And we've got a couple. What's these fertilizers? Yeah, fertilizer bags. Oh, we've got a toolbox. Now this is pretty cool. Uh, the toolbox is that you can carry it around wherever you want. You know, you can put the toolbox in the back of the back of the truck, and you can always fix your you know, or change your um, your service and change your machines, which is great. Got some front weights there. Anything in here? Nope. Okay. Yeah, it's nice to get started off with that equipment. Uh, we're just having in case there's some stuff. Okay, so we got a uh, combine over here. Looks really. Oh, it looks really well done. I love the canvas roof as well, because you know, if you're working in South America, it's warm, isn't it? You know, it's the perfect combine for it. Um, you're outside, you know, getting all the dust kicked up in your face. It's beautiful. <laughs> um, obviously, got our little, uh, our little Massey Ferguson there. Oh, and we got oh, this is the Star ST Max 105. Okay, so this is one of our new. Um, one of our new tractors, which looks looks really nice. 105, I think that's the horsepower, 105 horsepower. And let's have a look inside. Yeah, fairly. Yeah, it's all fairly what you'd like to see in a the tractor. There's plenty of buttons. Got the handbrake, forward and backwards, and you've got a like sort of GPS ready for um, 
before we start doing some field work. That's lovely. And I did see... There we go. So the sugar cane. The sugar cane. To harvest sugar cane, you will need a sugar cane harvester. It removes the top leaves and cuts the thick sugar cane stalks into small compact pieces. Just as a forage harvester, sugar cane harvesters do not have their own tank and is required to accompany them with a tipper. Brilliant. Okay, so this is... I think this is a single row again. Uh, so when our sugar cane is, is grown... Um, you know, we can use this then to, to harvest it and use the trailer. And I wonder if we can just stick the trailer straight on the back and just tow both that and the trailer. We'll have, we'll have a look. We'll have a play. And, um, it was, okay, is it a little workshop or something in here, is it? Yeah, nope, can't get in. Okay. Well, and that's it. I think we've done a full sweep. We've seen, is there any more? No. Oh, we're good to go. Ah. Oh, the train. Hey, the train is good, isn't it? Oh, no, no. Don't move anywhere. But, um... Okay. We'll leave it as that. But thank you very much for watching, peeps. This is just the uh, the intro, really. Uh, just going around the farm, seeing what we got. See what we've got to work with. Um, I hope this has been... Uh, um, informative <laughs> for you. And I will see you all uh, in the next episode very soon where we get down to some farming. So thank you very much for watching. My name is Stockgloss. Take care and ciao for now.